Hello, this is my book and it's called That's Not a Hippopotamus and it's by Juliet McIver, that's me, and the illustrator is the brilliant Sarah Davis, you can see her name there. So we can see here the teacher and all the kids are racing after the hippopotamus. Oh, maybe that's not a hippopotamus, what's that? Hmm, let's open it and see what a hippopotamus really looks like. Ah, that's what a hippopotamus looks like. How to tell if it is a hippopotamus? Here's your handy guide. So, a hippopotamus has a hefty thump, a grub top, a bumble buffer, not to be mistaken for an elephant's trundle bumper, and also a flobble waffler, four plodders, donk, 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 a snort gobbler, wifflers, and piggy bobs. Okay, so now that you know what a hippo looks like, let's read the story. That's not a hippopotamus. And here we can see little Liam. And he is a quiet and observant child. And what do you think he has seen here? He's good at looking at things, you see, and finding things. Yeah, footprints. They are ant footprints. Maybe not. Maybe hippo footprints. Aha! That's a clue. Right, here they all are. The children have arrived at the safari park. And here's Don. At Don Safari, understand, with every creature in the land, all roaming wild, safe and free, so many beasts for you to see. Then this little boy says, That's a lie, a whopper, miss. He's got no hippopotamus. What a rude child. Well, what has he got? Let's see, he's got a yeti, a mongoose. He's got all sorts of strange things. He has a dugong, a naked mole rat. Goodness me, numbat, wombat, vampire bat, even a cricket bat. Hmm, what kind of safari is this? Let's see if he has a hippopotamus. Oh, of course I have. Come right this way. He's by this lakeside every day. Oh my giddy gad, he's gone! We'll find him, don't you worry Don. We'll spread out wide, hunt high and low. We'll have him back before you know. And off they go, glomping off. Dun, 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 dun. All except for little Liam, because he spotted the hippo footprints, see? And they're all going this way. And the kids are all going that way. Oh dear. Let's see if they can find that hippo. Golly miss, a lot of miss, a missing hippopotamus. Good thing we're here, the best hands down of hippo hunters in the town. Can you see the hippo in this picture? Hmm, I'll move it up closer. Can you see the hippo hiding in the picture somewhere here? There! No, wait a second. There! No, that's not a hippo. Oh, wait. Oh, there! There he is. Let's see if the children can find him. Ah, this little girl says, I see him, miss. He's super tall. I'll fetch him in no time at all. I hope he's super tall. Hmm, what do you think it is? Oh, what's that? Hmm, a giraffe. And she says, I got him, miss. I got him, miss. I knew that I could spot him, miss. And everybody says, that's not a hippopotamus. Oh dear. But Liam is looking in the right direction at the hippo who is over there. No, 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 no. Over there. Ah, oh, somewhere over this way. Can you see him? Oh, right up here. Very faint and tricky to see. That's Right, so Liam will surely tell everyone where he is. Excuse me, miss. I think I see him. Off we go then. Come on, Liam. We'll do it good and proper, miss. We'll find that hippopotamus. Good thing we're here. The most superior hippo hunters in the area. And this little boy, he says, I see him, miss. He's on the ground. I'll get him while he's snuffling round. Hmm, what do you think it's going to be? Maybe, uh... What? What 
What has he got? What kind of creature is that? A warthog. And he says, I got him, miss. I got him, miss. I got him by his trotter, miss. And everyone says, that's not a hippopotamus. Hmm. Can you see the hippo? Look, everybody's laughing. Ha, ha. That's not a hippo. But Liam has quietly spotted the hippo somewhere. There's the hippo. No, silly me, that's the hippo. No, look again. Hmm. What do you reckon? This one? Ah, uh, no, that's an elephant, definitely. Look, it has a trunk. Oh, wait a sec, not a trunk. What? Oh, it's a sock. Oh, it's a very well disguised hippopotamus. And he's looking back at Liam. And Liam says, Excuse me, miss. I think I see him. Come on, children. Quiet, Liam. No one never listens to poor Liam. I'm missing hippopotamus. Need a hippopotamus. Good thing we're here. The greatest band of hippo hunters in the land. And here she is with her pointy stick. I see him, miss. He's very quick. I'll chase him with my pointy stick. What could it be? Something very quick. Something very quick. Hiding up in the tree. Ah. Uh, ooh. I got a miss, I got a miss, I knew that I could stop a miss. And everyone says, that's not a hippopotamus. Goodness, no, that's a snake. Look, look up close, can you see the hippo? Not on that page. Maybe somewhere on this page? Hmm, here, no, that's a frog. Oh, you mean here, that's a frog. Well, wait, well, that, ah. Uh, I think that's a rock. Oh no, that's the hippo's snout and you can see his eyes. Wow, he's really well disguised there, isn't he? And look, there's Liam looking right at him. And Liam says, excuse me, miss, I think I see him. Off we go, be quiet, Liam. Ooh, does that happen to your teachers some days? It's hard work being a teacher. I'm missing hippopotamus, the trail is getting hotter, miss. Good thing we are here, the very best of hippo hunters in the West. And here they go, oh, this one, he says, I see a miss, I'm on his trail. I'll grab him by his stripy tail. Stripy tail. I'm thinking probably not a hippopotamus, a tiger or a zebra. Could be, let's see what it is. Ooh, what's that? Ooh, it's a skunk. And he says, I got a miss, I got a miss. He smells all stinky, rotten miss. And everybody says, that's not a hippopotamus. And off they all go, wah. Can you see the hippo in this picture? Let's see, he's somewhere up high. Where is Liam looking? Up that way. Mm hmm. There he is. You can only see the hippopotamus's bottomus. And Liam says, Excuse me, miss. I think I see him. Come on, children. Move it, Liam. And off they go. Ooh, scary. What's that? A shark. And she's diving in. And can you see the hippo already on this page? Pretty quick spotting. Let's see if we can see him. Are you pointing at this one here? Is that the one that you think is the hippo? I think you'll find you're mistaken. That's a tourist. See, he's wearing sunglasses and a hat. Hippos don't wear sunglasses and a hat. Hmm. Let's see if the children can spot him. There's Liam. He's looking that way, so it must be somewhere that way. Here's Lila doing some clever plotting and mathematics. Lila's quite a plotamus. She'll find that hippopotamus. Good thing we are here, for all it's worth. Best hippo hunters on the earth. I see a miss. I see his fin. Watch me, miss. I'm diving in. <gasps> this is a scary part of the book. Let's do some shark music. Oh, it's 
another shark. What is that? It's a dugong, which is kind of like a manatee or a sea cow. And she's got hold of him and she says, I got him, miss, I got him, miss. He's slippery like an otter, miss. That's not a hippopotamus. Well, do you know what? I think they're just going to have to give up. I think they're just going to have to go home, go back to school, and they're, never, they're just never going to find that hippopotamus. Can you see the hippo on this page somewhere? Where are you looking? Here? No, we've discussed this already. Remember, this is the gentleman who is a tourist taking photos. See, you can see his camera and his shirt. Hippopotamuses don't walk around with cameras. And the children are saying, Stinking hippopotamus! What a lot of bother, miss! He's ridiculed the lot of us! We're nothing but the most forlorn of hippo hunters ever born. Home we go then. Fingers crossed that blooming hippo isn't lost. Excuse me, miss. What is it, Liam? The hippo, miss. I really see him. <gasps> well, I never. Aren't you clever? The greatest hippo hunter ever. And there's his great big shadow. And finally, we got him, miss. We got him, miss. We got him by his bottom, miss. Ah, oh, so that's a hippopotamus. There they all are holding him up. And then on the last page, the hippopotamus is taking them all for a ride back to school with Liam on the snout. Hooray! And then the very back cover, you can see their class photo. And there's their teacher, Mrs. Whiskersniff, and all the kids who went on the adventure and an unidentified mystery animal in the back.